fish farming everywhere. Korea is sea bound on three sides and has many rivers and lakes. Vigorous efforts are made in the Democratic People's Republic of Korea to increase the marine resources. Mobile cage net fish farming is brisk in all parts of the capital Pyongyang according to the regional characteristics. Che Uk Cho, chief engineer of the Pyongyang City Fish Breeding Management Bureau, says. <laughs> 자연수육들이... We raise fish at the cage net fish farms installed in natural waters, including the Daedong and Potong rivers and the Chundung reservoir. They get benefits from breeding different kinds of fish layer upon layer according to the depth and quality of relevant waters. They manufacture and install net cages in accordance with the regional characteristics and raise the effectiveness of fish farming to increase the production. They regulate the depths of net cages in the deep Daedong River to increase the production per unit area and expand their area in the shallow Botong River. Active efforts are also made in the coastal areas to increase the marine resources. South Hamgyong Province directs efforts to putting the offshore fish farming and culture on a scientific footing according to the oceanographical conditions. The Hodo Offshore Culture Farm rationally combines the cultivation of marine products of different kinds, including mussel. It improves the water quality and provides favorable conditions for the growth of breeding varieties by combining the cultivation of seaweed and mussel. The Pumo Sea Fish Farm produces various kinds of fish in the culture grounds and releases fry in a scientific and technological way. The farm built the seawater and freshwater culture grounds under the favorable condition that it is situated in the place where seawater joins the freshwater. And it stocked the sea and river with more than 100,000 fry. Amid the brisk fish farming, more and more units breed fish on a mass scale in consonance with their actual conditions to get benefits from it. The Dadonggang Battery Factory, the Ryongsang Bearing Factory and many other units introduce profitable fish farming methods, making a contribution to the diet of their employees. The marine resources of the country will increase all the more thanks to the efforts of those units that push ahead with fish farming effectively while introducing rational methods suited to their visions and actual conditions.